Azerbaijan represented again in this second heat of the men's 400 meters and we've one of the current 400 stars of the European scene in this race also in lane two for Albania is Astrid Kriesiu lifetime best of 47.83 for Azerbaijan Arif Abasov but to be competitive it will have to be a lifetime best for him Winner of the European Team Championships last year and bronze medalist in Zurich at the European Championships last August. Donald Blair Sanford for Israel. Alexander Babian of Moldova will go in lane 5. 47.93, his lifetime best and the season's best, not that far outside. Mario Gebhardt of Austria goes in lane 6. 18 years old. Or Slovakia in seven is Lukas Privalinec. 20 years old, as is in the outside lane for Bosnia, Borislav Dragoljevic. Bosnia and Herzegovina. The man they all have to beat is in lane four. Donald Sanford, who finished behind Britain's Martin Rooney and uh, Matthew Hudson-Smith in the 400 final in the European Championships at the Let's Grund in Zurich last Start August. Ladies and gentlemen, A great championships. He was the Israeli Sportsman of the Year for 2014, and he won this race last year. Kresiu of Albania in two, Abbasov Azerbaijan three, Blair Sanford of Israel four, Babian Moldova five, Gabart of Austria in six, Prepa Linec of Slovakia in seven, and Dragoljevic of Bosnia and Herzegovina in lane eight. So away the first time of asking Blair Stanford's lifetime best is 45-21 now a naturalized Israeli national after being born in Los Angeles and what a big boost he's given to the Israel national team it really is all about him Dragoljevic doing quite well for Bosnia in lane 8 and Privilenic for Slovakia in 7 but it'll be in the closing 200 meters where the class of Donald Blair Sanford will begin to be established. He's hit the front already. It's all about second place from here, really. Dragoljevic of Bosnia now being bested in second place in lane six by Gebhardt for Austria. But look at the gap. Blair Sanford well out in front. It's going to be maximum points for Israel without any doubt at all. 57 76, very good. Babiana Moldova took second place in the end. Uh, wasn't very far away from his lifetime best. It's certainly a season's best. And it'll be a game's record that could stand for quite a while. 45-76 for Blair Sanford. And rounded down even further. Fabian came good. Late on for Moldova to take second place. Gebhardt and Dragoljevic had been up there for quite a long time. Nowhere near in the class of Blair Sanford. Very, very impressive time. An impressive winner and maximum Israel points. And the interesting thing there, he would have been down to the stadium and had a good look around and seen the quality of the track and the environment. And with his experience, he would have known uh, there could be a good time in my legs for this. A great track, great environment. And we're talking about warmth here, which is fantastic for these athletes in the power events to get the best out of those sinews and muscles. They really have perfect conditions here. No wind. It may be windy outside, the windy city, but inside this track, it's uh, it's in cost. And it's a beautiful surroundings for athletics and these power events. Pure power and strength from Donald Blair Sanford. And still in his prime, 28 years old. And for the second year in a row, he wins this event at the European Team Championships. Four nations going up. That 
that would put him in contention really in the top division as well. So Dragulievich third for Bosnia, Fabian second for Moldova. But for Israel, Donald Blair Sanford, he's a golden boy. Almost two seconds to spare ahead of the rest. PB for Abbasov for Azerbaijan in fifth also.